Hey everyone, the new Star Wars movie is coming out and where I live they only play it in 3D and this sucks for me because I wear glasses and I don't want to wear the other ones on top. So many other people have this problem and I'm going to show you what I came up with here. I have Zenni optical glasses and I have magnetic clip-on sunshades that go over the top. They're another six dollars I believe. And what I ended up doing is taking my spare set and just moving the 3D lenses over to this one. And just like that, I have 3D glasses. And these are actually 2D. I use two left lenses and that filters out the 3D image that I don't really care for. And a lot of people feel the same way. So if you wear glasses and you're looking for a comfortable solution and you want either 3D or 2D, stick around. I'll show you what I did. So getting started, I was able to pop this lens out. And there's just a small crease in here and you can kind of work them out starting with the top or bottom and the lens pops right out just like that so now I have the magnetic clip-on piece so now all I have to do is get the lenses put back in from my 2D glasses here and these are the regular 3D glasses you can get at the theater and how I actually ended up making these is they're just two left lenses in here and I actually glued it back together here. So my goal right now is to make 2D glasses, but you can make 3D glasses by just pulling the lenses, putting them right back into the other. And you wanna make sure to keep the orientation the same. I, I'm not sure that it affects it, but I believe uh, other people have mentioned do not accidentally turn them the wrong way. So they don't fit but I have enough lens there that I should be able to trim them out and get them to pop right in. And once I'm done, I'll have a really easy solution for going to the theater then, whether I want 3D or 2E. So I'm going to go ahead and make this lens and I'll find, see which one I had here as a reference. And I will just start trimming this until it fits and we'll make one cut and then spare you from the boredom. But it cuts pretty easily, not much to it. Alright, after trimming them down, it cuts really well with the scissors and I was worried about it maybe compromising the uh, transparency of it a little bit, but it seems just fine. I screwed up a little bit, it's not perfect, but it's almost barely noticeable. Once you get it all popped in, there's just one little edge there. I cut out a little bit too much, but there's actually just enough lens. I can cover up the whole thing. So just like that, and then my other one, I will just pull out and do the exact same thing. And there you guys have it. I hope this works out for you, worked out good for me, enjoy.